let's just sew whatever. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be opening mail. Um, I've been kind of saving up quite a bit for this one. I just got this in the mail yesterday. It's a blankie um, from Tiffany at The Girl Who Sews. Um, it says... Lauren, don't look too close at this because I know I made mistakes, but I just wanted to say a very big thank you for all the sewing knowledge that you share with all of us. I started in garment sewing back in the day and your videos and lives have taught me so much. I meant to make this for Dorothy a while ago, but wedding prep kind of derailed all my sewing plans for a couple of months. Congrats, by the way. Hopefully it's not too small now since I know babies grow so fast, but here's a little token of appreciation for all that you do. Good luck with the new storefront, and I hope you and your family have a wonderful Christmas and New Year. <laughs> Hi, CJ. Uh, it's so pretty. She's gonna love it. She's gonna freak out. Oh, look at the. Oh, that is such a good little size blanket, too, especially for like car seat. Oh, I love it. It's so pretty. And you can have never, you, you never can have too many blankets. You can never have too many blankets. So thank you so much. Um, these are art supplies that I have ordered. Um, these are from Arteza. Um, I do have an affiliate link with Arteza, so I'll be sure to include those down below. But I ordered the um, metallic color watercolors and a set of regular. And then I also got some postcards. I thought it would be a fun video to... Um, show you guys how to use these paints to make greeting cards for the holidays. So definitely keep an eye out for that video. It will be coming soon. Obviously I haven't filmed it yet because I'm just now opening these. Um, but Arteza is a super affordable brand. Oh cool, it even came with a little watercolor brush pen. How cool is this? So they're little blocks of watercolor that you unwrap. Um, but if you are looking for a gift for someone for the holidays that you know is artistic, um, or maybe even someone that's a little bit younger that likes, like when I was 10, all I wanted was paint supplies and art supplies, etc. And these would have been great gifts because they're a great price and also really good quality um, for beginners and even more advanced art students or artists in general. But they're these cute little pans that are water activated so you just undo them all. You can even reorganize them as you would like in this sweet little carrying set. And then I'm super excited for these metallic ones. I see a lot of art videos on Instagram. I'm always like, oh, metallic paints, those look so beautiful. Um, and this also includes a water brush pen. So I think that is really awesome that it's like a kit all together. And here's what this one looks like. Oh. I'm so excited to play. And it even gives you a little tutorial on how to do it. You can swatch them. So when you're planning out your project, you've got a little swatch board here. You can see what it looks like on black paper and white paper. So very cool. I love Arteza products. Even before I worked with them, I loved their products. And then these are the... Postcards. It comes in a great little tin to store them in. <laughs> and they're in really thick watercolor paper. So they're going to hold up nicely and then you can write a little note, add your stamp and send it off. And the next thing I ordered is from Dick Blick Art Materials. They had a sale on brushes and their stretcher bars. So I got a handful. These are the Robert Simmons brushes. Just 
super beautiful. This one's covered in a little bit of glue to keep it together, but it'll come right out. It's water soluble. Um, so I've got the TT85 round brush, um, some flat brushes and another round brush. These are just absolutely beautiful brushes. I had to have more. Um, but then I got a bunch of the nine inch stretcher bars so that I could do more of those um, fabric stretching, video not videos, but for decorating. And then I saw sold out was having a sale. Um, they posted in so whatever about their sale. So I was like, yeah, I found something. I always love supporting as many small businesses as possible. And they had these really cool ones. Oh my gosh, I love this packaging. I got some that said Savage. I was like, okay, those are, those are awesome. So I'm just gonna open this so I could reuse it. Oh my gosh, cool. So there's some stickers, a little business card. Definitely have to put that sticker on our cutting table. It came with a keychain. And then I got some rainbow zipper pulls that say Savage in like a drippy font. But they have all kinds of different zipper pulls you can check out on their website. All right, and this next one came from the UK um, from Laura at Lil Stitcher Sews. I am super excited to open this check it all out. I love how well packaged it is. That's amazing. All right. So I ordered all kinds of stuff. They were having a Black Friday sale and again had to support. Okay, perfect. So we have an exclusive discount. So whatever. It's 15% off the website. It says, thank you so much for your order and supporting my small business. I've included a few little extras to say thanks. I've been watching you on YouTube for over three years now. You inspired me on my bag making journey. I hope to launch my own channel in a few weeks. Ah, that's exciting. Have a wonderful Christmas and New Year with your family and friends. I can't wait to order the grand opening box. <laughs> I'm excited. Okay. Oh, everything is so pretty. Okay, so I ordered the Ruby Star Society. I don't even, I think it's this one that I ordered. So pretty, but I think she included this one, which is also gorgeous. And some Rifle Paper Co. because you have to. Oh, these colors are amazing. Oh, and this. Oh my goodness. I actually debated on ordering this. And I was like, no, no, I don't need it. Um, I think this one is, yeah, this is The Full Moon by Helen Black. Might help if I were holding it up correctly, but it's a bunch of little panels. I mean, how can you not? So, so cute. I'm actually really excited. I might just like frame these and hang them on the wall or something. I wouldn't stretch these just because there isn't enough seam allowance, but like, oh, amazing. How did you know? <laughs> so cool. Um, but I also ordered a couple of the vinyls. And these are half meters. So this is the Santiago Gray Pearl. Ugh, 
one of my favorite backings. It's super lightweight. You can interface it to make it nice and sturdy. So exciting. This one is the Teal Valencia Faux Leather Half Meter. Look at that color. So this one is um, a very nice backing as well. It's more like the marine vinyl and it's a nice weight. It's not too thick, but again, you can interface it for extra strength. Wow. So this is the silver metallic Valencia faux leather. So it has that same great backing and like, hello, look at that color. And it's not too sticky. And again, not too thick. I believe she sews using a Janome HD9. So I figured it can't go wrong. This is the copper metallic faux leather. Gorgeous. And then this one is the light pink. Stop it. So, so pretty. Um, and I absolutely love the way the website is laid out. It's so well organized. Um, there's matching threads for the fabrics and even matching lining. And then these are the threads. She sent a couple extra. I ordered the teal one because it matched perfectly with the vinyl. Um, but these are Tex 40, which I believe is awesome for the Janome HD9. So I'm excited to play with these. I have so much, so much stuff to play with, not enough time. Um, but yes, so again, that is from Little Stitcher Sews in the UK. And we have a 15% off coupon. So whatever, if you want to buy anything. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me for a little bit today, and I will see you later. Bye.